So I had Argentina. So let's well, 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 hey. <laughs> <laughs> Bengals in Tampa Bay Sunday afternoon. Weird storyline here, bro. Because even though Mac Jones is literally the baby goat, people insist on comparing Burrow and Tom Brady. It's bizarre. But here's Joe on the correlation. Take a listen. It is what it is. You know, I don't really pay attention to it. He's Tom and I'm Joe. I really just think that, you know, I play, I play the game my own way. Uh, you know, I kind of have a little bit of everybody. Uh, you know, there's not, I wouldn't say there's, you know, one thing I do the best, but I would say that I do everything with the best of them. You know, there's, I wouldn't say I really have a, a glaring weakness. And so, you know, I, I like to be my own player, my own person. I would say that's why. Mm, about Guys. the glaring weakness, what about wearing hats? <laughs> okay, all right. Uh, <laughs> Super Bowl champion Greg Jennings is here. Nick, are you buying the uh, Burrow-Brady comparisons? 100%. Really? Yeah, I mean, first of all, it just makes <clears> sense <throat> from a football perspective because they are both their biggest strengths to me, their accuracy, their poise, and they're playing the clutch. Mm -hmm. If we want to go kind of story also, both had to fight in college to play. You know what I mean? For Brady, couldn't yeah. start over Greasy, and then had to, you know, f he went back and forth with Henson. Burrow had to leave Ohio State because he couldn't get past JT Barrett. And, and then, obviously, Brady didn't have the season that Burrow did and wasn't the draft pick that he was, but their college stories are similar. And neither one of them wow you with their physical tools. And what Joe said, it's interesting because I totally missed on Burrow coming out of college. The, I liked Herbert more in that class. I liked Tua, oddly enough, more in that class. And it was because... And Dusty and I used to argue about this. I said, he's not great at anything. And now Burrow is better than I thought, obviously. Mm -hmm. But what he's saying is, yeah, I'm not like the best in the league at anything, but I'm top five in everything. He didn't say that. You know what I mean? I'll right. say that for him. I will say this, though. This is Joe's third year. I believe through three years, he's f way ahead of where Brady was. And I understand Brady through three years won one Super Bowl and Burrow lost the Super Bowl. But Burrow is a better player and Bur than Brady was at that point in his career. Burrow has played far more and won more than Brady has. The Super Bowl win versus Super Bowl loss notwithstanding. Because you remember Brady's third year, they missed the playoffs. Right. Mm -hmm. That was the one year that he missed the playoffs healthy his whole time with the Patriots. So I, I do buy the comparisons. I I don't think it makes him the best quarterback in the league, but I absolutely buy the comparisons. Yeah, I'm with you, and I buy the comparisons, too. Um, and here's another thing people don't really think about. Both of them went to teams that were bad. We don't think about the Patriots as being bad. They were 5-11. and 11. They had missed the playoffs the two years before Brady started, and, and they were 5-11 and 11 when he, the year before he took over. And 0-2 oh and when Bledsoe got hurt, and then, you know, the rest is history. Brady just – I mean, nobody saw the Patriots as a team that was going to be that good. And he turned it all around, obviously, just like Burrow did. Here's the one thing I'll disagree with you on, Nick. I initially would think, yeah, just looking at it, oh, Burrow's better. Obviously, his individual numbers are way better, right? People thought Brady was a game manager, a system quarterback, sure. and Burrow is obviously the driving force yes, in Cincinnati. Sure. However, here's the thing. Burrow has Jamar Chase, T. Higgins, Tyler Boyd, not to mention the running backs, Mixon and, 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 and P. Ryan. And I, I'm not going to make too much out of them, but B uh, Brady never had that type of talent early on. I mean, he had David Patton and mm -hmm. Deion Branch yeah, and Troy Brown. But, like, it wasn't really until he got Moss that his numbers skyrocketed. And then it was like, oh, my. He's not only a great winner and leader. That's true. This dude is individually great. So, I think had Brady had the type of receivers not that, that Burrow, I think he would have. Because his numbers weren't. He made the Pro Bowl the second year that, when he missed the playoffs. And Burrow has yet to make a Pro Bowl, strangely, but still. And so I, I do think he could have probably put up those numbers had he had great receivers. Yeah, I, I buy the comparisons. I think it's more for me like the way they carry themselves. Like the, you talk about the accuracy on the field and what they do. Joe Burrow's a better athlete. Like everything that Joe Burrow does, I feel like he does it better than Brady did early in his career. Yes. Like we're, we're comparing a three-year starting quarterback to a – 
20-year career of Tom Brady, a culmination of who he became, not just who he was out the gate. And so, yes, there are some comparisons, but Joe Burrow, for me, out the gate, you talk about all his weapons. Well, yeah, I'm building around this guy. Tom Brady had a defense. That was he their driving defense, force. But, which this thing's defense in So bad they were asked to do things differently, and Joe Burrow has answered Every, every question. You every don't think question. had Brady had I don't. The, a top no, three absolutely. No, they threw no. one touchdown pass in their, their first Super Bowl run. He was not Different until. Guy. He didn't have great receivers. It was, no, but, it, but I mean, we remember those games. We remember the Super Bowl he won, John Madden thinking they were crazy to put the ball in Brady's hands and let him try to go hit that game-winning field goal. We And I understand that Burrow has Chase, but he didn't have Chase for a month this year. And he was fine. And Brady had, early in his time with New England, a far better, forget defense, offensive line than Joe Burrow yes, has he had. Did. Uh, by a mile. <laughs> yes. And a more reliable no running that. game. I understand Joe Mixon used to be a great back. He is still a good back. And P. Ryan's been the, And P. Ryan's been good, but I think a lot of that's because teams are selling out to stop the pass so the run is available to them because mm-hmm. everyone is terrified of what they can do. Now, a lot of that is they have a great receiving core. But I – and I am not predicting that Joe Burrow is going to go – to 10 Super Bowls. How could he when Mahomes will go to most of them? But the, I, what I am saying is that through, That's the second topic through he's gotten three years, through somehow. three years, Chiefs. I think that Joe Burrow is way ahead of schedule yeah. to where Tom Brady was, even though Brady won the Super Bowl it's and a, Burrow I, lost You, you with that? I, no, if you won that, you mean we're – I'm a count the rings guy. I like it. It's a nice, course. simple way to look at the – I mean, it is about winning. Yeah. And I'm just know. saying, like – Maybe I'm I, I, I get his Lost numbers way ahead of Brady's. I'll give you uh, But they're going head-to-head uh, in Tampa. Greg, is there a chance that Burrow outplays Brady, even though Brady's going to throw the ball 50 times? That Burrow outplays Brady? Yeah, who do you no, see? No, that Brady outplays Burrow. Well, either Brady's way. The same I, question. I mean, it's yeah, but property. Burrow will outplay Brady. Okay. There is a chance that Brady could outplay Burrow. That's the only way his team can win. But look, Burrow just – you talked about all the weapons he has. I'm picking the Bengals. When, when I look at these two, like, the ultimate respect is when you get to play against the guy that they're comparing you to. Yeah. And you just throw the ball around the field mm. and just embarrass it. Like, Brock, not embarrass him, week, so. but, like, show him, like, not, this is it's my time now. It's a now. new day. It's my time now. No, I hear that. I, I Look, I, I think I agree. I, I think Cincinnati will win. I think Burrow probably has the best game. But, yeah, I'm not at the point where I'm saying – no, Tom Brady can't outplay so and so. I'm not at that point yet, and I think Brady could can, go out there and have a better can game. Can I ask they question to. to the group? Because yeah, I know yeah. Wilds is out on the Bucks entirely. I'm not, but, but I want. But I'm no, just, you are. I'm, you I'm are out on being disappointed. The okay, all right, that's fine. You don't want to raise your expectations to get disappointed. I understand that. Question to the group because I'm the only person at the table that believes the Bucks will be dangerous come January. If the they, bu- they won't make I, the playoffs. Okay, Greg has them out of, <laughs> the out of the playoffs. That's totally fine. Greg has them out of the playoffs, and you guys have them winning, getting in the playoffs, not 100%, but likely in the playoffs, and then being an easy out. If this Sunday they beat Cincinnati, be nice. Will that <laughs> validate? What will that validate? Yes. No matter what they do the rest of the year that they should be feared come playoff time. A Cincinnati team they, that needs the game, that is red hot, that Cincinnati is fighting, still alive for the one seed, and still alive, and still right now, though, not even leading their division, tied for the lead. If they can beat this, if, if they can beat this Bengals team, will you say, oh, okay, there is a gear Tampa can get to? Depends on how the game plays out. If it's just an ugly game, and it's 13-10, and it was ugly, and the offense just squoke by, was squeaking by by a field goal. At the, I'm not ready to say but that. But why can't they win wow. playoff games that way? Why can't they win a they playoff game? Right. The they, they, they can't run. They're I, the I, worst I, running team in the league. It's just it's not going to work. My Tom, answer is no, Nick. I mean, Even if it they was la- Remember last week I said if they beat San Francisco, yeah, I will be yeah, with you. Sure. Obviously, they got pummeled. Right. I, they got to right. win. They got to look great the Wilds, next Wilds, I know you're weeks. the questions guy. I just one very quick follow-up. 
if Cincinnati loses, are you going to be out on them again? Like, I'm, you're I'm, playing I'm hopscotch a with the I'm Bengals. a who day. Yeah. I mean, they're oh, not okay. my pick, yeah. but I'm down with who they now. Oh, okay. All right, got it. Yeah, I got, got it. Buffalo, but I'm down with who they. Oh, okay. It's all right. Okay. You have a lot who of chips on down with them now. Yeah, no, he, he eliminated. I'm from Cincinnati. I know, so I'm a Cincinnati guy. Kind of. 